and Q, your host for today's house tour video. And join me as we open the door to this beautiful spotted house that is newly built, modern Asian inspired in an exclusive subdivision here in Montilupa City. So come on, let's go explore and experience this home. And as we walk through the facade of this property, you can see the beautiful house and it's very much detail-oriented. And one thing that you will also notice about this property is the gate or the lack of. Because as I've mentioned, this house is situated in a very exclusive subdivision. So privacy and security is very much evident. So this house and even the neighboring houses doesn't need much of your gates. And as we walk come closer as you can see we have this lush full of greens and beautiful landscaping in front of the property this garden actually goes through the left side of the property and if you come a little closer of course we cannot open the beautiful door in this house without taking a note of this gorgeous hardwood door and of course since it's modern we have here the lock that is card or number activated as you can see and so let's go inside and upon entering this property we will be greeted with this beautiful expansive open layout and i love how clean the vibe is and how detail oriented it is and on the left side we have the door to bedroom number one and upon entering you can see it's a very spacious with a ceiling fan and some lights and of course a provision for your television and cabinets and on the left side of this room is the door to the ensuite toilet and bath this ensuite toilet and bath features a full-size mirror a sink a water closet and an enclosed shower space That's it for the ensuite toilet and bath for bedroom number one. And of course, well, this is dressed to be the bedroom as it is in the name. This room could actually be used as an entertainment room or a family room or even an office since it's situated in the first floor of the property. And did I mention that it also includes an air conditioning unit? And as we step out of that room, we can go back here in the main living area. And looking up, you can see it's a double height ceiling, which gives the space a bigger and wider feeling. And of course, you can see the lights they used are rattan. And I love how it's Asian inspired. So it gives a warmth and of course, a loving and homey feeling in contrast to the white and black colors that they've used. And on this side, we have this beautiful wall designs which you can still convert into an EV or whichever you choose. And we also have two air conditioning units in this floor area. And since it's an open layout, of course, this area you can have your dining area here and it's really big enough to have a six-seater table. And since it's a seamless flow in the kitchen you have here, we'll be greeted with this beautiful center island with ample space for the feet and of course it's already dressed with some chairs over there and it also has some storage spaces underneath and i love the details as i've said in this house because as you can see if you open the drawers it's soft close so you know that even the small details are actually well thought of and it speaks of quality and you have here the stove and the range hood and the refrigerator, it's two doors, also included in this property and I love how it incorporates the triangle design. So you can use the sink and then you can use the stove and the refrigerator flowing seamlessly, which is, which is the most used actually in a kitchen. So it's very important that you have a smooth flow. So I love it about this. Also have this beautiful ceiling design right here. And this area is divided with this design right here and I love that you can see through it so it won't restrict your eyes it won't make the space look enclosed and I love it about it and if you move on this side and we have here the powder room and the ground floor and I would like to showcase this powder room because of how spacious it is and of course the design and the tiles used the water closet also includes a bidet and of course 
a sink and a mirror that's big enough to check your outfit of course if you have guests and if you're thinking when it's enclosed in an area on the side this work closet actually is perfect because i'll show you why this door actually leads to the car garage so as you go home and as you enter your house you already have an easy access to the toilet and of course this area right here has a provision for a table a console table and of course there's a socket so you can plug in your devices and air freshener or whichever is your lifestyle and let's go to the car garage making our way to the car garage you can see how big this car garage is you have four car carports so you can easily fit in four cars right here and if you have fewer cars it's okay because that's an extra space and as i've mentioned really gates aren't really required or needed in this subdivision but the designer already included gates for your cars and if you look up you can see that this car garage is covered so your cars are very well taken care of and if you take a look at it of how big it is if you're having parties you can actually put it here and you can have your friends and guests over because if you look on this side you can see it has this beautiful gorgeous view so much lush greens it's what i love about this subdivision is because of its exclusivity privacy and it's surrounded with greeneries which is very hard to find in metro manila so have to take note of that and moving on this side Coming from the car garage, you can go to this area. As you can see, there's a pathway here going to the service area. Of course, we can take a look at that later. But first, I want to show you guys this door. And what's behind it is the auxiliary kitchen. Of course, an auxiliary kitchen is a must-have. We have here a space of the countertop and the stove, a range hood a sink, and of course, a provision for a refrigerator on this area. Naman. And I love, like I said, this house is very detail-oriented. So to save space, they made this rack. They can have your spices and bottles right here. They just fan girling over it because it's really cute. And if you walk a little bit on this area, we have here another access to the service area, as I've mentioned before. but. We're still not taking that i'll show you another access point and on the left side you can see this gorgeous big window which lets in a lot of ambient light of course this will save you some electricity and some energy and i just love it about this house going back ta-da we're back in the main area we have here of course again the kitchen and the dining area we have this beautiful lanai over here I want to show it to you guys. And I like to take note of the screen door. So you can open this at night and you can just close the screen door if you don't want to let bugs in. But so far, I haven't seen any bugs, no man. And you have here so much fresh air and so much greenery. I wish if I can just let you guys feel the wind through the video. But as you can see, it's very relaxing, very much fresh air and the situation of the subdivision is it's very accessible even though it's exclusive, it's private, it has lush greens but of course you have nearby highway and schools so you, basically you have everything in this area and so let's go back inside and as we walk through I want to note also the paintings are also included in this house this is from the personal collection of the developer so it's a personal touch and we have here some accents that gives the Asian vibe for the house and over here there is the sliding door I'll show you the third access to the service area come on walking on this side you can see there's a staircase that has access to the service area but before we go down there I want to mention that on this left side of the property is the garden that I've mentioned earlier in the video. Of course, it extends from the front of the property to the side. And I just love all the lush greens that are personally chosen by the developer because they're very well thought of and of course, very well curated. 
So guys, if you are having fun so far and you like this video, don't forget to click the like button and of course subscribe to our YouTube channel at The Spot TV and ring the bell button so you will be notified when we upload our other online house tours. And you can also follow us at our other social media platforms at Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok at The Spot TV. And you can see there's still so much greeneries on this side. And here are two rooms. They are actually are not dressed in any way, so you can do whatever you want with it. It can be your man cave or your woman cave. It can be your gym or it can be an extra room for your guests. It's really up to you. So it really depends on your lifestyle. It can even be a family or a movie area. Let's go inside. I'll show you. Actually, these rooms are identical almost to each other. It's very plain. So there's a lot of ports for sockets. So it's on each side of the wall. So really, it's a blank space. It's a blank canvas. It's really for you to design and personalize on your own preference. And this door leads to a powder room. And let's go walk on the back side of the property. So you can see, as we go on this side, we have an access to the maids and drivers' quarters. Come on inside. And we have this, this area for the maids and drivers' quarters. And I love that it has two toilet and bath for each of them. And of course, the bedroom, which I'll show you guys in a while. But I want to take a note of this side. So there's a lot of provisions. There's a lot of sockets. And the sink is over here. Actually, this area is very spacious and is a very well thought of for our helpers. Here, I'll show you the toilet and bath. It's actually spacious. It's very spacious. The two toilet and baths are almost identical. Both have sink, wire closet, and a shower. And actually, there's also a ventilation over here. And the second door is the space. And we have here. It's actually ample for a single size bed and a double. And the other room. So actually, they're almost identical. It's just the paint that are different. And if you remember earlier in this video, I've shown you guys this spiral staircase. So it's connected to the upper floor. So ito yun. So you have access here. But we're not gonna take it because as I've said earlier, we have three access points. The one we entered in, this one, and the third one which we will exit. way on the staircase leading to the car garage you will take notice how expensive this property is it is because this property sits on a lot area of 338 square meters with a total floor area of 475 square meters so that's very impressive and let's go back inside as i've mentioned we have access here and what I love about it is, you can remember that if you have a console here, so you, when you arrive from work, you can put your bags here or your groceries. Of course, whichever scenario it is. And we're back in the main area. And of course, let's go head upstairs so I can show you the three bedroom. But before we go there, I want to take note of this wall design that is made of rattan. It's very nice because it gives warmth and texture to the property in contrast of course to the two colors that you'll see in this property which is mostly just black and white and then the warmth of the wood and making our way upstairs i love that the floor and the steps are actually made of solid wood so there's very much quality and over here we have another design which we can appreciate how asian the design is and as it draws your eyes up 
you know, can see the ceiling, the chandelier and the ceiling then. And it's surrounded with cove lighting. So it actually gives a nice emphasis to the light. So you have full appreciation of the view. And of course, the sides are made out of solid wood too. And we're here on the second floor. The floor is made up of real wood, of course. And if you look on this side, you can see that there's another lanai there. But I'll show you to you guys later because I want to show you first bedroom number two. Bedroom number two, or technically bedroom number one in the second floor. As you can see, as you enter, it has this very large, expansive space. And if you look up, we have this ceiling fan, which will cool down the place. But even though they have a ceiling fan, they also have an air conditioning unit. But my personal favorite part of this room is this panoramic window, which has the view of the subdivision. As you can see, there's much greeneries. There isn't really much houses yet built, so you have a lot of privacy in this area. And we have here built-in wardrobe cabinets. And what I love about it is the color and the tone. So it's darker and it's cooler. And of course, we have an ensuite toilet and bath. But all bedrooms in this property have an ensuite toilet and bath. And as you can see, I love how this mirror can be opened as a cabinet so you can put your medicines and skincare here. We have the sink, the water closet with bidet, of course, as Filipinos, and enclosed shower space. The shower is outside so we can easily fix it. And the drainage is larger than usual so to avoid clogging. And that's it. That, this isn't even the master's bedroom, but already it has a nice view, nice details, and even the bathrooms are nice. And on this side is bedroom number three. As you enter, you can see, you can appreciate the ceiling fan and the cool lighting. Of course, also included is an air conditioning unit. And if you imagine, you can have your bed here in the middle and two side tables on the side because you can see uh, tall windows. And but this bedroom, naman, the competition is, this have a walk-in closet. We have here a space, actually has more cabinets. You can dress here. And besides the walk-in closet is the ensuite toilet and bath. So after taking a shower, you can easily change your dress here. The ensuite toilet and bath is pretty much identical to the other one. We have the mirror that is lighted with LED and also has access to the cabinets for your medicine or your skincare. Sink, work closet, bidet, and an enclosed shower space with dish. I love how the niche gives a cleaner type so you don't have to put racks and then your soaps and other toiletries. So it's like that. And this area is really still expansive. So it's an open space. So you can have another table here, another living area. You can have tables and chairs right here. And it also has an air conditioning unit. So you know that even the second floor open area will still be cool and nice. And we have here a nice portraits and pictures so you can change that or you can have your family portraits or you can retain that it's very tasteful naman. and here's the access to the lanai that I was talking to earlier talking about earlier so you can see you can have the property but it's covered with this so you won't get a lot of heat from the sun so it's covered and nice and it have easy access and cleaning this glass window so that's actually one of the perks of having a lanai when you have a nice window. And if you have a nice window, of course, you can let in a lot of ambient light. I would like to mention this on this side, this, because it's the double ceiling height. As you can see, you can take a look over here and you have a view of your living area and that is lighted very well with this other panoramic windows. And as you can see, you can even put some other portraits right there. And I love, of course, the incorporation of the designs of Rattan and Woods because it gives the Asian vibe. So it's not just modern 
so it won't feel just cold. It will feel not just a house, but a home. And we have the master's bedroom. And as you can see, of course, this is the biggest among the bedrooms on the second floor. We have an air conditioning unit. And let's go over on this side. I want to show you guys the walk-in wardrobe. What I love about this walk-in wardrobe is it has its own chandelier. It's a lot of storage space as you can store your clothes right here. But if you walk a little bit on this side, you have here these drawers. So you can have your accessories, watches, scarves, or even handbags stored in here. And this area is a provision, of course, for your vanity mirror. So if you're having makeup on, you can have it right there. Or even your luggage area, you can put your big luggage suits right there. And as a well thought of design, it's right beside the ensuite toilet and bath. There's, there's so many amazing things about this toilet and bath. First off is the dual sink, so you can have and brush your feet and get ready simultaneously with your partner and how large the mirror is, so it gives a illusion of a bigger space. I mean, don't get me wrong, this bathroom is already big, but it gives like an additional space. We have the wire closet and the bidet, uh, windows, and an enclosed shower space with shower niche but we have here also a bathtub and so i love how it's just beside the shower room so you have easy access but at the same time it's separated so you can take a shower while your partner takes a bath or vice versa and well, after seeing this master's bedroom, you'll think, wow, a large bedroom, a pretty big closet, and a beautiful ensuite toilet and bath. It's probably the perfect master's bedroom, but actually there's more. And this is actually one of the highlights of this area is the lanai. So you can have here this beautiful view with a space. You can have your morning coffee strapped here. I mean, right now it's in 12 something in the noon, so the sun is pretty harsh. But earlier in the morning or later in the afternoon, it's very much cooler in here. You can see the greeneries everywhere, so it's pretty relaxing. No? Imagine waking up with this view and an access to your lanai. And that it is for our bedroom number four. And if you guys fell in love with this newly built modern Asian home, let's go over the details at our property details recap downstairs. Let's go. This spotted brand new modern Asian inspired house sits on a lot area of 338 square meters and with a total floor area of 475 square meters. This property has four bedrooms, four toilet and baths, four car carports, staff room with toilet and bath, auxiliary kitchen, a main kitchen, powder room, a lanai, a provision for gym, garden, and family recreation area. This property boasts wide frontage and high elevation with breathtaking view. And that is it guys for our property details recap. I hope you guys are all inspired with the Asian aesthetics of this house. It's really refreshing to have Asian culture reflected in modern architecture. And of course, don't forget to like this video, click the subscribe button, and ring the bell button so you will be notified when we release our other videos. And of course, follow us at our other social media platforms at Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok at The Spot TV. Once again, I am Q, your host for today's house or video. This is our spot, our channel, the Spot TV.